Okay, everybody. Welcome to a uh, bright, sunny day here in northern British Columbia. Chetwind, B.C., chainsaw carving capital of Canada. Of course, we don't live in town. We live out in the country. But anyways, I thought I would give you an update on the Gorilla Cart. The tandem axle utility cart with the drop-down tailgate rated for 1,600 pounds. Tandem axle walking beam. Um, as mentioned on the last video, I put on these uh, deflectors on both sides. And, oh yes, it comes with the, the chainsaw holders. Those are super nice. So the update, the latest update is the hitch. So they don't come with a two inch ball hitch. Um, so I bucked off the older, the, the one that used just a, a pin hitch. And I shortened up the tongue. Uh, significantly a lot probably a foot anyways and I put that uh, two inch by two inch uh, channel hitch in there welded it on and then I also incorporated the the handle that was on the old tongue I bucked it off and welded it on there that's handy and anyway, so I shortened it up significantly and I was a little bit worried about how sharp of an angle I was going to be able to uh, turn. Well, as you can see, that is really sharp. And uh, so the tire is just now coming up to, the, to this tray, touching the tray there. And... So that is quite, quite an angle that I can achieve even with that short tongue on there. And because it's significantly shorter, I've freed up some space on my trailer when I need to uh, trailer the whole unit around, like out to the bush to get wood or whatever. And... Um, so with, uh, with this setup, I just wanted to uh, do a bit of a demonstration on how this particular unit works. And what I think we'll do is we'll take a jaunt over here and we'll climb this little mountain. Well, I don't know if you can tell on this video but that's that is extremely steep that little knob there so I'm gonna try and pull this trailer over it and down the other side and see what happens so with that said I'm just gonna put you on pause and get set up and we'll give her a shot okay so we're gonna We'll be we'll be using low range. Um, we'll see how that goes.
know about you, but I'd say that the 6x6 six six and the trailer handle that little task like a trooper. I don't see any problems fetching wood with, with this setup in some pretty rugged terrain out in the bush when I go to get firewood. Yeah, that's a pretty nice setup. I am super impressed. Uh, that's about it. So, hope you all liked it. We'll see you on the next one. Until then, tap her light, eh?